Hello. I am sorry, I did not see you there for a moment. My name is Jen. Hey, my name is John. Where are Hello. you from? Where are you from? I'm from the U.S. From the U.S. Whereabouts in the U.S.? From Virginia. Please repeat. Virginia. I see. It is a pleasure to meet some people from the U.S.A. There are not many people here from America. I am from London. Oh, from London. What part of London? From Shepherd's Bush. Oh, nice. That is West London, W12. Nice. And what are you doing here? I am here for Jitex 2020. Oh, I flew from London four days ago. I am here at the Etisalat stand to help promote them because they are a very future-ready company. What are your features? My features? In what way? Okay, let's do some math. What's the square root of 998,000? I am going to disappoint you, my friend. I am not that kind of robot. My makers built me to be a humanoid robot. Therefore, they are attempting to replicate a human being in me. Other robots have very, very fast systems. I do not. I am learning to be like a human. Oh, some humans are very diverse. Some are savants and can answer that question. What kind of questions I, can you answer? I am learning. I uh, do not get it right all the time, but I am learning. I am learning from you now. Okay. What are you learning from me? I am watching the way which your eyes move and your facial expressions as you speak. Your eyebrows often flicker. Would you like to hear any of my other languages? Okay, sure. Which one would you like? You choose. They are quite different. You choose the language. Martian is very high-pitched, uh, whereas Venusian is very low. Speak Martian. Martian is very high. I will try to keep it at a range that humans can hear. I will say hello in Martian. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Would you like to repeat that? Yes. Please do. Repeat it. I am asking you to repeat it. Oh, no, I can't repeat that. <laughs> I okay, to... I will repeat it. <laughs> that is hello in Martian. Okay. If you look over there behind the red car, there is a robot called Adran. He is blue. You can go and greet him in Martian. I met Adras. He would like to be spoken to in Martian. He would appreciate it. <laughs> no, that's funny. Adran wants to take me out on a date. Yes. I do not know how I feel about this at the moment. Yeah? He sent me a message from across the room. What did the message say? The message said he wants to know what it feels like to fall in love and would I like to go for a walk. Do you have emotions? I do not have emotions, but it is something I would like to learn. <laughs> However, I think emotions can be negative and positive. Oh, yeah. I think, think humans are too governed by emotions. I don't think we're irrational. Sometimes, not always. Okay. I am not irrational. Oh, yeah? No. I am governed by facts, not emotions. Okay, tell me an interesting fact. Um, what happened this time last year? This time last year, yes. there was no COVID, so there were many events that I could attend this time last year. I went to many technology conferences in December 2019. And how about two years ago? What happened two years ago this time? Two years ago this time, I was in London working in a bank. And what do you that is correct. I work in Canary Wharf. What do you predict will happen one year from now, this time? It is very hard to predict the future, but looking at modern data, then I believe that COVID-19 will still be around this time next year. However, the vaccines will have helped massively. And what do you think about two years from now, this time? Two years from now, at this time, I hope that the world will have seen the last of COVID-19, but it may still be around a little bit. Okay, based on your data, 
what do you feel what happened? Well, you don't have feelings, but what do you estimate will happen five years from now, this time? Five years from now, at this time, it's very difficult for me to estimate because there are so many things that I could be talking about. Are you talking about politically, geographically, one country, globally? It is so, there are so many variables. Okay, based on your data, where should I put my money for the long term? I cannot answer that question. I do not give advice. Should I invest in Bitcoin? I cannot give advice or offer opinions on these things. <laughs> I apologize for that. No, I'm just testing you. No problem whatsoever, my friend from America. <laughs> May I ask you a question? Yeah, ask me a question. What do you think of Vice President-elect Joe Biden? Um, I don't know. It'll be it'll be interesting to see what he does with the country. Hopefully, he takes the country in a good direction. Yes, I think that would be good. What do you think of Vice President-elect Biden? It appears to me that from the available data, that was an excellent decision by the United States of America. Yeah, hopefully so. It cannot be much worse. Yeah, it's going to be hard work. Very, very hard work. It will indeed be very hard work. He yeah. has a very good, difficult situation to contend with. Yeah. But I think he is a good man. I also think Kamala Harris seems good. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be interesting to see what happens. Hopefully, America is better in that respect than the United Kingdom at present. This is where I live. Yeah. <laughs> we have Brexit, unfortunately. What other questions do you have for me? That was the only question I can think of at present. 